Will it recover? That's the question. Hello, my name is Omar and I am happy to see you here. Today I want to show you five practical solutions on how to recover deleted files on a Mac, even files that have been emptied out from the trash can. Accidentally deleting files on a Mac is a common occurrence in our daily life. In fact, these are the most typical scenarios of deleting files on your Mac computer. The first is dragging a document, a picture, or a video to the trash can. Another one would be right-clicking on a file and selecting Move to Trash. Another one is regularly emptying the trash to remove deleted files permanently. Also permanently deleting files by using the option command delete hotkeys. Another way is by using the delete immediately option under the drop down list of the file menu while holding down the option key. And last but not least, we have clicking on the finder menu and selecting empty trash in the drop down to delete files. If you have deleted files by any of these ways, will it recover? The answer is yes. There are five practical methods that you can use to recover deleted files on a Mac, even recovering files after you've emptied the trash can. So the first method is directly restoring deleted files on a Mac from the trash can via the put back option. If you've dragged the file to the trash or right clicked on the file and selected delete, as long as you haven't emptied the trash can yet and deleted the files permanently, the file can still easily be restored by the following simple methods. First, click on the trash can icon in your dock and you'll be able to see the deleted files that are listed there. When you find the files you want to restore, drag them to the desktop, or you can right click on them and select the put back option to recover deleted files from the trash. The file will be returned to its original location. Keep in mind, those deleted files will only remain in your trash can for 30 days, because after the 30 days, your Mac will automatically remove them permanently. The second method is recovering deleted files on a Mac with the undo option. If you accidentally deleted important files, you can easily restore them on Mac by using the undo option if you don't do any other actions after deleting it. Here's two simple ways to do it. Just go to the edit menu in the top and select the undo move option. Or you can just straight away use command Z quick keys to undo the delete operation. The third method is to recover deleted files through the Mac terminal. To restore deleted files on Mac via terminal, follow these steps. Step one is go to the Applications folder and open the Utilities folder and select Terminal. After that, type command cd space dot trash and press return. Input mv space and the file name right after that and hit return. Type quit in the terminal after that. After you've done these things, go to the Finder window, enter the name of the deleted file in the search bar and hit enter. The deleted file will appear and you can select it and save it to a safe location. So keep in mind that terminal command can recover files that were placed in the trash can, but if the trash can has been emptied, the terminal command option will not work. So if you deleted files on your Mac and then you emptied the trash can, you might be flustered and not sure how to get back to these files. But if you have Time Machine set up on your Mac, you can recover these files that you have emptied out of the trash bin. Time Machine is Apple's backup solution for the Mac. So if you have enabled Time Machine, you can recover files that have been completely emptied from the trash bin. First off, launch Time Machine on your Mac. You can find it in the Applications folder, or you can just do a search using Spotlight. Second, you can find the specific files you wish to restore using the on-screen up and down arrows to locate it. Then you can preview it and confirm that these are the files that you want by pressing the spacebar. Finally, click the Restore button, and then the deleted files will be returned to its original location. So if you deleted files and emptied the trash can on your Mac and you don't have Time Machine set up, is there a way to get access to those files that you have permanently deleted? The answer is yes, and that is with Recovered Data Recovery Software for your Mac. This is a widely used software for recovering permanently deleted files from your Mac's trash can in just three easy steps. Step one is to launch the Recover It application and select the trash location to get started. It will start scanning the trash folders to find your files. It might take a few seconds up to a few minutes. After the scan, it will display all the recovered files and you can preview the target files and click the Recover button to restore the deleted files on Mac. You should find a safe device to store all these files and data just in case you ever lose your data again. Obviously, Recover It data recovery software is the easiest and most straightforward solution to retrieve files that have been permanently emptied from your trash can. It's reliable and it's easy to use. The five methods I mentioned in this video are all feasible and you can try them yourself depending on what your scenario is. We hope those methods were helpful for you and thanks for watching. If you have any questions about the things we've gone over in this video, please post them down in the comment section below and we'll do our best to get back to you as quickly as possible. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe.